What's up guys, Fishing with Ben back with another video and today we're going to be talking about when and where to fish for bass on windy condition days. Let's get into it. Now before we get into this video, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe. So usually on non-windy days, clear water is where you can sneak, well, clear water is where the bass will be able to see you easily because when you, whenever you can see the bass, the bass can always see you. That's a matter of fact, if they swim away or they don't. But so when the wind is blowing, depending on how fast it's blowing, either way, it makes a chop on the water. And therefore, on when you're fishing on windy days in clear water, the bass won't be able to see you as easily. And also, it is also easier uh, on windy condition days to catch monster bass. Because the bass won't be able to see you. Because usually I've seen bass where they've been on beds and I roll up to them and it's like a five pounder. But they get spooked off because you can it's clear water and you can see them. But on windy condition days, they're going to have a harder time seeing you. Now, we're going to talk about the fish or position. The position is a big role in where to fish for bass on a, on a windy day. So the bass like to be on a point on a windy day because the wind will be chopping over top of them. So here's the point right here, kind of like a, like the point or that's a point just where it has like a, where like the water runs through here and like it makes like a point, like a tip of a triangle. So the bass are going to be probably sitting right here on that point. And when there's water flowing through, for instance, this shad's flowing through here, the bass are going to want, not really, they're, well, they're going to have, well, they'll take an easy meal. Like, they won't, um, they won't not accept that easy meal. But they're going to hit this shad, for example. This is one of our baits that we can use. Um, but they're going to come out of that point and bam, eat that little minnow that's going to be swimming down through the lake or river. Now. We're going to be talking about the baits that we can use for fishing or for bass fishing in windy conditions. Now, the baits you want to use are crankbaits, spinner baits, swim baits, and jerk baits. Now, more than likely, all those baits are fished fast, but some of them you can fish slower. So, if the fish are just a little bit finicky on that windy day, you can fish them just a little bit slower. But, like that spinner bait, that swim bait, can both be fish, fished fast. Now, the when the when it is windy, the bass are grouped up. So, say they're on that point right there, and the bass are right there. There could be like ten bass right there. So, instead of just throwing it in there one time and catching one bass, I say throw it in there a second time, see a couple more casts, see unless there's some more bass in there, because when they're grouped up. They're usually grouped up in one, one place. So, for instance, on windy condition days, they'll be on a point. So they might be all grouped up on a point. Now, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Make sure to hit that like button and subscribe. So I haven't been fishing much because I went out Sunday and I caught like three sunnies. And that was about all. And I went out Monday, caught a two inch bass. So I'm hoping to get out some more outdoor videos. I just had to make this video because it has been, has been a while since I posted the last video.